Welcome to Conscious News. We have another great story here for you today. Russian scientists have apparently reversed the flow of time in an experiment they conducted on a quantum computer. The finding is unlikely to lead to a time machine that would work on people, but the team of physicists managed to restore IBM's public computer to the state it had been just a moment earlier, according to a research published Wednesday in the journal Nature Scientific Reports. A nuanced result, but one that could have striking implications for the future of computing, quantum physics, and our understanding of time itself. Quote, we have artificially created a state that evolves in a direction opposite to that of thermodynamic era of time, unquote. Gordy Lezovic, a quantum physicist from the Moscow Institute of Physics and Technology who led the research project, said in a university published press release. Go on to say that just like research into quantum teleportation has nothing to do with transporting people, there's no reason to link this study to the notion of a machine that could travel through time. Rather, the scientists hope that their work can help a quantum computer. Scientists make sure their software is actually doing what it's supposed to by kicking it back through time and double checking its work. Now that sounds good, and I'm sure you understand um, the implications of this type of technology. Um, when the military industrial complex gets their hands on this, and that's if they already don't have um, money in the research of this already, um, they're going to use it to um, manipulate time. Um, just as they do with quantum teleportation with people, um, why else would you want to teleport except to move things? So we have to be able to read between the lines. Um, just thought I'd bring this story to you today and um, just make us look at the reality as we know it um, differently because things are changing. We are in the age of quantum computers. Um, thank you for tuning in. And this has been another episode of Conscious News. Stay tuned.